it is befitting that I leave the game just like I came in, beating a big bad monster who knocks out everybody and no one can whoop him. That's when that little Cassius Clay from Louisville, Kentucky came up and stopped Sonny Liston, the man who annihilated Floyd Patterson twice. He was going to kill me. He hit harder than George. His reach is longer than George. He's a better boxer than George. And I'm better now than I was when you saw that 22-year-old undeveloped kid running from Sunday Liston. I'm experienced now, professional. Jaws been broke, been lost, knocked down a couple times. Bad. Been chopping trees. I done something new for this fight. I done wrestled with an alligator. That's right. I have wrestled with an alligator. I done tussled with a whale. I done handcuffed lightning, throw thunder in jail. That's bad. Only last week, I murdered a rock, injured a stone, hospitalized a brick. I'm so mean, I make medicine sick. Bad dude. Bad. Fast. 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 All of you chumps are gonna bow when I whoop him. All of you. I know you got him. I know you got him picked, but the man's in trouble. I'm gonna show you how great I am. See, most people's version of Ali is really distorted because their version of Ali is Ali post the three-year break. Yeah. And he, when he came yep. back and fought Jerry Quarry, he was not the same fighter by any stretch of the imagination as he was in 67. <laughs> it wasn't just ring rust. When he became old, he, he didn't do yeah, shit. Three years he older. didn't even go to the gym for three years. Yeah. He didn't do anything. Yeah. The Cleveland wow, Big Cat Williams fight is, in my opinion, one of the greatest performances that any boxer ever put on ever. It was a, a, a know, real big, strong guy, a dangerous guy, coming after a genius. The way he did it was just poetry. When you watch him fight Sonny Liston, there, there's a book called, uh, I read it uh, by David Remnick called King of the World mm. about that fight. Yeah. And, and, and what was amazing about Ali is Ali said, Sonny Liston is the baddest guy on the planet, right? But the one thing he's afraid of is crazy. Yeah. So he acted crazy. He would park his car on Sonny Liston's lawn in the middle of the night and start calling him out. He said, come on out and find me now, Sonny. And Sonny was actually afraid. He said later on, he goes, I'm afraid this guy might bite me. Are you sure this guy doesn't bite? And so Ali knew he could get into his head. He was also like a, like like Diaz. I mean, he's a psychological warrior. He yeah, get of course. Head, you know? well, he was the first. Yeah. yeah, he was the first to figure out. So he was a genius. They had to hold him back. His his blood pressure was so high when he was doing the way, and he was trying to get at him and talking to him. The guy and and Sonny listened. They to him, almost didn't let him crazy. fight. Yeah. yeah. The thing about Ali was that three year break, and then after that three year break, then he fights, fights Jerry Quarry. He fights Joe Frazier and loses. He's not the same guy. No. He's just not the same guy. And then he became a guy who was known for not just moving. But taking punishment He just didn't move The way he used to move right. If you look at the old The old movement His shuffle uh, His footwork <laughs> It's fucking genius Ladies and gentlemen Mr. Muhammad Ali Has just refused To be inducted into the United States Armed Forces. People don't Very realize nice. what a cultural hero that Muhammad Ali was, because what he had done was stepped up and said, My conscience won't let me go shoot my brother. Or uh, some darker people, or uh, some poor hungry people in the mud for big powerful America, and shoot them for what? They never call me nigga. How can I shoot them poor people? I would just take me to jail. You know, and he's right, and he was 100% right, and everybody knew it, and it made sense. And because of that, they punished him, and they wouldn't let him box for three years. Right. You know, they took away his livelihood in the prime of his career, like physically. I 
fly rat with a Pyrex and a fly checks. I'm cracking a black, I'm a prospect, I'm a fly rat on a dock for the dope, I can die sick. Uh. It's a lie.